Members of a local Baptist church feel cheated. They are accusing their minister of fraud after they donated their hard-earned cash. 10 News reporter Steve Fiorina looks at the battle now being waged in Superior Court. It's a house of worship where wrangling over money has led to accusations, people leaving, and people suing. A very small congregation attends Cross Point Baptist Church, just a few dozen people. Founded in 1958 as the Pomerado Road Baptist Church, it's fallen on hard times and is now in escrow. This lawsuit by one plaintiff claims the senior pastor is to blame and is seeking the sale either be halted or the proceeds placed into a locked account. We're trying to get, um, get the congregation back. He wants an audit of the church's finances, citing a lack of transparency. A lack of financials given and financial information given to the members. And that's led to a situation where he's had unfettered access to funds um, without any accountability. We called and visited the church, but Pastor Shields refused an interview on the advice of his attorney. He sent a note to 10 News saying, the pastors and the board of deacons do deny many of the allegations being suggested by an upset minority of our church's membership. There is no indication of a criminal investigation, simply the civil suit. The plaintiff's attorney, Seth Bobrov, claims the congregation has been wrongly stripped of certain members, including the head deacon. Over the last five years, he's systematically gotten rid of people who want to be members of the church by um, alienating them. People want to come back to the church. People want to be part of the church. And he is causing problems. He said if the church is sold, space for services might be rented, perhaps at the local high school. A judge will hear from attorneys again on Tuesday. Steve Fiorina, 10 News.